My name is Joe Murray from the Mayo Clinic in Rochester, Minnesota. I'm talking to you about a recently published article um, on the risk of non-celiac autoimmune diseases in family members and spouses, interestingly, of people with celiac disease. This study that um, was undertaken in Scandinavia using a very large um, cohort of people with celiac disease, over 29,000. And what was done was this was linked to what's called the multi-generational registry, which allows connections between the patients with celiac disease and their family members and spouses. And this study searched for autoimmune diseases affecting these family members and spouses. And what we found in this study was that there was an increase in the risk of these autoimmune diseases, especially type 1 diabetes, um, sarcoidosis, um, and lupus, in these family members. It was not a greatly increased risk, but it was significantly so. Why is this? Now this could be because these diseases share the same genetic risk. That people in the same families may share some of the same genes and with those genes may come the risk of similar diseases of which celiac disease is, belongs to a family of immune disorders. What was a little surprising was the risk affecting spouses, in particular women, the, so wives of patients with celiac disease. Now it's possible that this could be due to what's called ascertainment bias, meaning that people when there's already a spouse with a diagnosis of celiac disease in the family may be more health aware and may seek out testing for symptoms more often. And of course it was women more than male spouses who were more likely to have these diagnoses. Again, perhaps related to women being more connected with health care, being more aware of symptoms, and uh, having greater um, accessibility to investigation for those diagnoses. But nonetheless, this suggests that family members of celiac patients not only need to be aware of celiac disease as a, as a risk, which is quite substantial, 10% of family members um, are at risk for our will get celiac disease sometime in their lifetime. But so also there should be an awareness of other autoimmune disorders in family members. Thank you.